Hey! You tourists, it's your boy Domination Dizzle back in the basic chugging the deuces. How we do? How we do in Texas, baby? Man, I got his back. You know what it is, know what it is, know what it is, know what it is, know what it is. Real man rise up, fake man rise down. Real woman rise up, fake woman rise down. Proud to our preacher, preach and preach on. And man, I got his back. You know what it is, know what it is, know what it is. And today's topic we're going to talk about is. I want to talk about hip hop. You know, hip hop lives. Do it live forever or they don't live forever anymore? Hip hop is just a vanishment, a va- a vanishment away. Oh, I know what people go look at. What what the hell I'm saying to this? What happened to hip hop? Seriously, you, what what really happened to hip hop? You know, back in the days, hip hop started from the the Bronx. Started from the roots after the end of the roots. Started from the element and the re element out of men out to get out away from the streets. Hip hop started from that, but people forget that. People did forget it. It's not just people just playing music or, or, or on the block block parties on the park. It started from the African American community or black American or descendants from Africa, descendants of the slaves, or free free black blacks. Or who own slaves or don't own slaves. I'm going to say it like this. Everybody be a part of it. Latinos took a part of the history as well. You got to give up the Latinos brothers and sisters. And so it's white brothers and sisters. They play a part from hip hop. Right along with us. Like rock and roll, heavy metal, all these other different genres of music. Everybody has their own different genre of music. Let's not play a race in there, even though it starts from Ruben S and our people. But we, we open and started open up for everybody. Hip hop is 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 an expression an expression of the culture. That's what I love about hip hop. Today's hip hop nowadays is talking about the same, same old, same old uh uh repeatment songs on the radio. I fuck more bitches, I get more hoes. Uh, I pop more uh, shot, Kamali champagne, Kamali champagne, Chris, or 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 uh, I got more cash and Jews and Jews and cash. I flash more ice and ice in the flesh of the Jew. Th- that's all it's talking about. That's all it's talking about. But what happened to people express about life, express about e- e- exp- e- expression, anger, control, politics, history. What happened to that? I miss Tupac and Big because those guys right there are the two most giant forces of keep the hip hop going. But who keeps it going, I would say, is Eminem, Lupe Fiasco, and Vinny Paz. They kept it going. But all these other people, they ain't, they ain't, they ain't about nothing. And, and I'm gonna tell you the truth, but 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 shout out to uh 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 Lord uh, Lord Jamal from 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 the new uh uh uh, uh brand Nubians. Shout out to him, man. I love Jamal and what he was trying to do. He was a pioneer, a part of it, and he followed me on Twitter. Shout out to him, cause I've followed him back. But hip hop is no longer the youth anymore. It's it's gone. It's just, but but and looking back at it, I think Nas was right. Hip hop is dead. I hate to say it. I said all you got to do is go out there and look around. How many rappers out there can really can rap? Really can rap? Not no scribble scrabble. Somebody else's scrabble. Somebody else's word. But scrabble of a written of a word they own words. That's an MC to me. That's an MC to me. There's a difference between an MC and a rapper. MC is rock the noise and rock the crowd. Move the crowd. Control the crowd. Just like a DJ. DJ is is, is bringing attention, noise, and noise and attention to, to, to feel the noise, feel the crowd. It's like the drummer of the hip hop. MC is like the singer of rock singer him, but rocking the mics, you know? The hype man is the hype of the show. You know, getting everybody hype and get everybody in, in into the gatherment and the gatherment of the people. That's what it's about. Hip hop is a goddamn joke. 
I don't listen to hip hop no more because half of the shit these rappers talk about, they don't talk about nothing. They talk about the same old, same old stuff. Same old stuff. I miss people like Public Enemy, MWA. I miss guys like Ghetto Boys, Two Live Crew. I miss people like Schooly D. You know the, the, the you know uh, 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 Ice T, Teddy T. I miss people like that. A ball M J D, A ball M J A ball M J G. I miss them folks, cause they are the real kings of Memphis. Way before Three Six Mafia, but they everybody thinks Three Six Mafia. But who really started is the is 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 A ball M J G. Those guys are the real king of Memphis. Come on. It's the truth. Come on. Three six. Come on. They started from ninety five. But 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 A Ball M J D they've been doing it for years. Let's be honest. In nineteen ninety one or nineteen ninety two. They've been doing that way before they did. Let's be honest. And they don't get the credit for it. They the real underground kings right there. You know? Ask Earth God uh your God, he'll tell you. I mean, come on. Look at hip hop now. I respect people like LL Cool J, DMX, Big Pun. I miss Big Pun. They keep hip hop going. And Big L. Look, look at all these rappers. You know, uh, uh, Grandmaster Flash. Uh, 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 the first rapper that ever got started is Curtis Blow. All these artists that I look up to, Heavy D. Look at all these artists. I don't care give a damn if they were black or white. And shout, shout out to Beastie Boys. R.I.P. to MCA. That motherfucker right there. Look at hip hop now. It's a damn joke. I respect uh, 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 Kid Frost. He was the first Latino rapper before Big Pun did. But Big Pun was the first Latino rapper go platinum in the fucking mainstream. I listen to people like Jay-Z and Nas. At least Jay Z in the business aspect, Nas and 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 then poet atmosphere. Look at hip hop now; it's a damn joke. I, I I believe hip hop is no longer is the voice of the people. It's not, and it needs to get back to the voice of the people because what way they keep this hip hop going? Hip hop is going to be disvanishment off of off the tomb of the damn coffin. It's going to be dead. I, I tell you this much, man. I wish. Pac and Big was here because those guys kept it going and they was the best. Those two. Those two right there. The only thing we have good artists left is Eminem, Lupe Biasco, and Vinny Pass. They keep rap going. But all these other rap, and also I, I can't forget Tech Nine. Come on. Hip hop today ain't shit. But back then it was something. When it got a lot of meaning. What happened to the creativity? What happened to the talent? What happened to the original? Be your own original person. ODB was original person that's trying to be himself. And R.I.P. O.D. I miss old dog, man, because that guy was hip hop to me. Hip hop is a state of meant of a fashion and meant as a statement, like a, MC, a, a rapper. A rapper is just somebody who rapping on the mic in the booth. Just writing pen and writing rhymes, but a but a but a MC is some you you rap at the top of your head like a mental dome and the dome, but mental off of the dome. What happened to that? I I, I respect hip hop. I love hip hop. I'll repeat the hip hop because it needs to get back to the real essence how it really got started, and not just from the New York thing, but the whole wild wide thing. How it got started from the West Coast to the East Coast. To the Midwest, to the dirty South. Let's be honest, hip hop is bullshit. There's no unity in hip hop. There's too many dead ass rappers. Camouflage, Soldier Slim, Jam Master J. How many more rappers we gonna lose? You got a a a a do I mean do B do B a some his name is. Do be or something like that. It's sad he died. And little Pat. 
He died. I'm telling you, all these rappers, all these rappers are gone. And I'm telling you, I don't see what the, what the hell the, what the next hip hop is going to be. There are good hip hop music out there. You just have to find it. But you but don't find it in the fucking mainstream because mainstream ain't shit. Like Kara Restaurant said, record company are shady as hell and still shady this as hell. No offense, Slim Shady, because these Slim Shady records, they still do what they do. But I'm talking about the real shady people that want to tell everybody what to do and all this and that. But people like, uh, 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 um, uh, uh, um. Uh, uh, Chief Keen and and all the rest of them and and, and Waka Flocka and uh, Two Chain and all that they, they they ain't shit. I listen to their content and their lyrics. They don't rap about nothing. I could rap better than these motherfuckers. You got good ass rappers can really can rap. That's why they show how hip hop was. People have been warned for years that if the hip hop where it's going. It's been warm for a very long time, and you, you and you can't tell me that look at look what's going on. At least DMX, he fought some hard time, and he was hip hop. All these people are hip hop right there. They, 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 this boy that's been shown, Master P, everyone, even Easy E, even Chuck D, Flavor Flav, those are the artists I respect right there. Man, I love hip hop, man. I love the Latino brothers do it. White and white brothers sisters do it. And black brothers sisters do it. But we open doors for everyone. Even I miss uh Heavy D, man. Come on, Heavy D and the boys, come on. Look how hip hop what it is now. It's a damn joke. But back then, this is hip hop. This is how it was at that time. And these young people don't give a damn. They don't even know the essence of hip hop. They don't even know what they influence. They disrespect their elders. Look where hip hop is going now. It started from the damn Bronx, from New York City. I forgot what the letters have a street or somewhere it started. Ask Karis One is how it got started, and then hit to the damn West Coast, to Dirty South, to the Midwest. Everybody create their own hip hop form, and I respect that. From the from the gangster rap to conscious rap. To 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 uh, uh uh alternative rap, different different uh pattern of rap, different different measurement and measurement agreement of rap. But I just want to ask your opinion. What happened to hip hop? Do you think hip hop become too commercialized? Uh 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 uh, uh should have been that commercialized because hip hop used to have been raw, used to have been street, it used to have been positive. Positive, positivity structure and structured ability. What happened to that? Have you noticed I never listen to the radio? Because half of these rappers, and I know I'm not the only one, half of these rappers ain't rap about shit. It don't make no sense. Have you ever noticed if you get a fucking mixtape, they can spit more more element shit, but then in the fucking uh, 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 v, b before LP release album, they don't spit a much... A little commitment shit on the records. Have you noticed that? Because look how hip hop where it's been now. They can't even give Tupac a fucking Hall of Fame in, in, in Hollywood. And Tupac fucking deserve it. Fuck Hollywood. And they don't want to give him a damn a, 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 a Hollywood Hall of Fame. All because he's a fucking thug. And they know damn well Tupac was more than that. They know that. They, 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 they hate Pac because Pac was spoken too much truth. That's why they hate them. The powers that fucking tro tro uh, troll can be. But they could give Lil Wayne a fucking hip hop. Are you out of your goddamn mind? At least Tupac is more hip hop than Lil Wayne. Tup Lil Wayne used to be hip hop. But where he is now, come on. After he disrespect Emmett Till, and you think that Trayvon Martin situation went down? Shit, I mean, come on. Look how hip hop where it been now. But now it ain't nothing. I'm done with hip hop. I'm fucking done with rap. Because rap is not like it was how I was growing up. When I was three years old, I said to myself, this is what I want to be right there. The big spot where right behind with those two left, ref biggest cat stars right there. I want to sit with side with them, Tupac and Big, because those guys did it. 
but but uh, but the rest of hip hop they got, they can keep that shit. I don't want it. I'd rather listen to uh, Goofy Fiasco all day instead of listen fucking Chief Keep Chief Lame shit all day. The real shy town is the fucking Twister, Do or Die, and 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 and, and Calm. Um, and, and, and not uh 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 uh, 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 uh Car- Carmen. Common, yeah, common, common sense. Back then they used to call him common sense, but now they call him common. Tw- Twister, they call him Mr. Tongue Twister. Now he's Twister. And do or die. And I listen to do or die. You know, do you run it, run it wide with the top of beating with a cat here, but top of or but do or die. I used to love that song. It came out in 1997. It came out that time. I was like 17 or 14 at that time. 14 or 13 at that time when that song first came out of the radio and listened to the damn video. I was watching your MTV raps. I watch a uh, uh, rap city and fuck BET. They take rap city off, off the fucking core. That's one of the best goddamn shows on the fucking BET history. And they take yo MTV. I mean, they take rap city off. They used to put BET Hip Hop Uncut. Come on, 2 o'clock in the fucking morning. Gone off at 3. They took that off. They should have put it in the fucking porno channel. What 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 history we passed left? Now we don't got no damn history. Look where hip hop is at now. Now it went from pop. Now they went from hip hop to culture mid of hip hop. Now it went from shit hop hip hop. It, sh- it it went from shit. It ain't nothing. You ask these t- people who Tupac and Big is, they don't even know. At least they got some lyrics. They put it down. These artists they got right now, these new artists, they ain't got no fucking lyrics. They spit the same thing to the same verse of the next man. They use the same fucking actual beat to the next actual beat for the other man. Fuck hip hop where it is now. But hip hop was at that time right there, that era. But it died since 1996 till it, 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 it was the real hip hop era in 1996. Now hip hop has died in 2014. It died because hip hop is not about shit. It's not about nothing. People stop supporting these fucking artists they got right now because half of these rappers ain't rap about nothing. But it's our fault. We don't support those type of artists that spit about something. You got real rappers actually trying to get out there in the radio they don't support them but they'll put them lame ass garbage they they dispute out there and that's hip hop that ain't nothing that ain't hip hop that ain't hip hop you gotta find real hip hop in the underground on the industry uh, uh, underground or independent uh, uh, industry but not in the fucking mainstream hip hop popping shit hip hop that ain't nothing People better wake up and understand, look what happened to hip-hop now. A lot of people said that rock and roll was going to die out. And that's still going on, even though it's about, it, they, they even said that rock and roll is about to die in, die out. They said the same thing about the blues. It was going to die in and die out. They did the same thing about the fucking doo-wop era, and it would die out. Look what they said about disco, disco era. That died in and died out because they tired of disco, especially the rock people era. They got tired of it, and they died from the fucking 70s. Look what's going to happen to hip-hop. It's going to die out there, too. Right along with disco, right along rock and roll, right along with oo-wop and, 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 and blues and funk. R.I.P. the real James. I mean, R.I.P. the uh, uh, Rick James, bitches. Rick James. That was a real fucking funk. Funk with it, what you know of. Come on. And the fucking devils that really actually start this shit. But fuck what hip hop it is today. But hip hop was that era that that time I respect then and now. And it need to get back to that. On, on, not in, in, the, on, in the old way, but in the new actual way for they could understand how hip-hop, how it really got started and what it really meant something. Now, hip-hop, it ain't meant nothing about anything. But that's my commentary. Give me your comments and give me your brief response. Give me your comments and give me your video response and tell me what you think. What happened to hip-hop? Is it become too commercialized? Or as or or it should or it should be enough commercialized. It is not enough street or too much street or not enough positive fluids 
or not enough influence. A uh, uh, too much negative influence has got to be a neg- neg- negative enough influence. Uh, not enough lyrics, not enough creation, not enough TV uh, creativity. Give me your comment, give me your response, and tell me what you think of this video, all right? All right. R.I.P. to hip hop forever. All right? All right. It's your boy Domination. This is back on the base of the jungle. This is how we do it. Takes a baby. Until next time, all right? All right. Peace and I'm out.